Hey, what's up guys? I'm Paper Gloves and today we're going to play some more Resident Evil. Alright, so last video we went around killing a bunch of zombies and then we read a note here that says if we don't destroy the head or dispose of the body then these zombies might come back to life. So for this, or for the beginning of this video, I've decided to... let's go on, uh, let's go burn some bodies. And with that, we're gonna need a few canteen. No longer need this. Um, I'm gonna use the beginning of this video to explore a bit, since we have a lot of uh, the initial zombies since they're down. We got some breathing room. But first, let's light these boys up. Where are they? There they go. I'm not sure how this works, but uh, I'm guessing you just. Oh, that. Wait, Chris, turn the hell around. Did that hurt me? Oh, we're fine. So, I guess, is he burnt now? Let's try this one. It's back away. I, I want to see it. Okay. Let's fill up the refill up the canteen. And those were the only ones here. The others are the other bodies are on the uh, other side of the room. About half. Yes. And because the door breaks, we're not gonna go there just yet. But I think those are all the zombies that I've killed so far on this side. So let's put that back in. And let's go exploring on this side of the room. Now I understand that most of the doors here are locked, actually. Yeah, the, uh, I don't know if I tried the one down here. It might be locked though. Oh no, it's open. I don't think I ever tried this one. Where does it go? Oh, it's a plant. We'll take that. Yes. Oh, and also yesterday, I looked at the difficulty. Because I'm like, man, why is this game so hard? But apparently, this is just normal mode. We haven't even unlocked hard mode yet. What's this? Unlit fireplace. Nice. Now it's lit. Limes carved into the relief glow red in the intense heat. Must be the map. So this is Oh, we're on the second floor. Huh. Oh, so the red is... Wait, 100% items in the green area? Red means we haven't got all the items there yet. Okay. Alright. What's here? Is there anything else here? Picture of a partly built niche. It looks an awful lot like the one you're in now. Okay. Helmets, which we do not have. So this is the only thing we have to explore here. Okay. Anything here? Key holder. Okay. Oh, nice area with a green herb. Let's check out this painting real quick, though. Picture of a woman being menaced. 
horrible painting. Look out the window. I believe this door is locked. Armor key. Should we only have the sword key? Let's take it slow. We can go through here, but there's zombies here. Let's see if we can try avoiding them. If I die, I'll just reset and come back here. Because I don't think this room is too small for me to. Oh, there's a door there. Let's go in here. Does this lead to the other room with no knob? Something shiny. You take dog whistle. A crumpled memo. Today, Sir Spencer told me to hide something where no one would find it. Well, I had this idea. I figured if I could somehow have it protected by a dangerous animal like the vicious canine that lives here, no one would be able to get near it. As far as I can tell, the mutt is always hanging around the second floor balcony on the west side of the terrace. And he ought to come running at the sound of the dog whistle. This is where you come in. The thing is, I reckon you're the only person that can get near that damn dog without risking a serious mauling. Which means only you can put this collar on him. The object that Sir Spencer wants hitting is concealed inside. You're the only person I can trust with this. Of course, you'll get something out of it as well. Remember that certain item that you always wanted to get hold of? Well, in exchange of your services, I just might be able to get it for you. This could work out well for both of us, John told me. Um, I think I know where that area is. Do we still have that picture? Huh. I don't want to just use that anywhere. Anything in these drawers? Okay. There's a book here. Pages are blank. Really? This journal? Oh. Botany. Uses of medicinal herbs. It is a well known fact that there exist many plants that are credited with medicinal healing powers. Since ancient times, mankind has been healing wounds and diseases using various plants. In this book, we will sample three herbs that are native of the Arclay Mountains and briefly outline each of their medicinal qualities. Each herb has a distinct color and a distinct medicinal quality. The green herb recovers physical strength, blue, toxins. Red has no real effect by itself. We found that mixing green and red results in magnified effects. Okay. Huh. All right. I think I've done that Resident Evil 4 actually, now that I remember. So we can mix up the herbs just to save inventory space. The door there. Is there anything else in here though? Doesn't seem to be. Okay, let's try this door. Where are we now? We're right here. Where will you lead us? Maybe some more ammo, perhaps. Oh, this leads us back around. Okay. So, if I go the other way, can I go back through here now? Okay, we just gotta go through this. If I go the other way, I'm assuming it leads us to the other door, I'm guessing. I believe there was a zombie there as well. Oh, of course there was. Alright, but I need to get there. It's locked. Oh, you're fast to rise. Let's see, let's try this door. It's locked as well. Yeah, yeah, just locked by the emblem armor as well. 
knickknacks. There's a door here. Is this locked? It's locked. Oh, I have the sword key. Oh, I don't. I didn't take the sword key. Jesus. Okay, I can't. Okay, how do I avoid you? <laughs> I'm dead. I'm alive. Oh, Chris, you are a husky man. Where's the other one? Oh, just barely managed. Okay. Let's try the sword key and open it. Try to do this in one save. Just to figure out what's in there. So far, I've only acquired the dog whistle and a green herb. And that's what was in that room. We need the armor key, which requires us going back. I don't know which key was in the spike trap. So probably either the helmet or armor, I don't know. Let's grab, but let's figure out what's in this room first, since we already have the sword key. And let's drop the herb in while we're at it. And the dog whistle. We don't need that. I have an extra old key. Okay, we can do this. Actually, I should have used the herb, shouldn't I? Just to make sure I... Because I'm gonna reload the save anyway. So I should just heal myself. Just to uh, make sure that I get through without dying. Actually, as a matter, matter of fact, let me just mix a herb just to try. See, it's healing. Oh, we actually have five increments. Okay, we'll combine those later. I didn't realize I had so many. That's not what I want to do. Oh wow, that brings us to full. Nice. So yeah, mixing two green herbs probably isn't as good as mixing a red and a green. Okay, so I... That way led us to just a green herb. And this way led us to the dog whistle. We'll see where this sword key brings us. He's still here. Actually, um... Yeah, okay. Right. I remember he was uh, hugging the wall. This the sword key. It's further down. Here it is. Where will you take us? I'm hoping it swings back around eventually because I'm pretty lost. Oh, and it does. That's awesome. Wow. We can get the armor key. Um. Where was that terrace? Okay, I'm actually really happy about that. Let's try the dog whistle thing while we're at it. I believe this was the terrace. Um, where was that window? I think it was over here, wasn't it? It's like, let's try it. Oh, we didn't take the whistle. For my sakes. Um. Um, okay, um, let's go here. Let's try switching the keys. I'm trying to do this, do as much as I can to not waste much time. So we can... You know, so we know what to do when we reload. Just so we don't waste any resources. Which way was it? So this way.
Actually, like, we only use a red and green herb. I mean, might not be that bad to just say, just, you know, if we uh, get pretty far, it might be worth a save. We have five of them. Yes, I will take it. And I will put the sword key here. And I hope that works. Well, that doesn't work. Okay then, now we know that that doesn't work, we gotta figure a way around this armor key. Which key was this? Helmet key, there's a lot of helmet keys. So I'm guessing the sword key brings us to one area then the armor key gives us another set of areas then so does the helmet um okay let's go grab the old key from that or yeah from that little basement thing if I can remember where it was that kitchen area we did Oh shit, that scared me. Uh, no surprises. I don't know what they're for. Let's go here. Still got the dead guy. Um, which one was this? Other side. Okay, and I believe this was the armor key as well. Sword key was down here. Probably grab the dog whistle. Have to be come around. Just gotta get past the dog that broke through the window. Pretty sure we could just outrun him. There it is. It's just an old key. So now we got two. Wait, was that a door? It's locked from the other side. Okay. I wanna burn these bodies. We didn't bring the canteen with us though. Oh, that's all there is to it. Okay. So the mansion does loop around. So we have a shortcut back the other way. Oh, dude, we gotta get past this zombies though. Maybe it's a better idea to take the safe route. Where I know it's clear. Yeah. Um, what is our next goal though? Hmm. Where have we? Oh, I know where we haven't explored. Okay. Yeah, let's let's go this way. Because every time we go through that door, it breaks. Well, it starts to break. So let's go where we initially came from. I want to take this. Let's go where we initially came from. And then we will explore that side. Alright, what is over here? Through this door, I believe. What's through here? Yeah. 
So that guy doesn't wake up. Then this was the sword door, which we've already unlocked. There was a dog here. Let's take it easy. It did break through that window actually. Okay, so it's not breaking through this time. Cool. In there. That's the bathroom. That's the dead guy. Which we really should burn. This is the shotgun door. Which we still don't know how to get. So I gotta figure that out at some point. Hopefully, it's over here. Must be one of the main house doors. Try this door, which we haven't yet. I uh, still need the armor key. She don't know how to get it. Let's go in here. Oh, it's open. Looks like it leads outside. What is this? Iron gate? It does. Well, we're protected by a little gate. Oh, this is creepy. Okay, let's go. Oh, it's an angel statue. Oh, <laughs> Oh, what the fuck? Oh my god, what do we do? Oh my god. This is horrible. I have my gun. Dude. Yo, dogs are impossible. I just, just let me get through here. Of course it is. What's here? Let me examine, please. The defiler of the cursed coffin. I'm dead. Am I dead? Dogs. Oh yeah, I'm definitely dead. Okay. So there's nothing we can do there. It doesn't seem like there was anything we can do there. Yes. Alright, so where the hell is this? I've seen this. I've definitely seen this. So there is a cop so we have to kill the dog, obviously, to get the collar, to get the object inside the collar. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's him. Okay. We're coming back here. Alright guys, so we're back and it is time to combine these. Oh, one bullet. Let's just toss that in. I don't know what to do with one and one shot, but let's throw that in here. Got the key, the dog whistle, and old key in case we want to unlock, unlock anything. Can't carry any healing stuff though. But I'm guessing we're probably gonna need some. Uh, those are red herbs. See, we got two. What does this do? Oh yeah, I think it grows a plant or something. Um, you know what? We do need healing, we'll just come back here. I kind of value that extra inventory space. And let's head out. Should I save? Hmm, probably not. That wasn't, what I did wasn't do too difficult. Now all that's left to do is to avoid the second zombie. Swing around to the terrace. 
I'm gonna find where to use that dog whistle. I think in order to do that, I gotta let him come. Avoid him like so. Okay. Um, you might get me, actually. So hopefully he reset it. He's turning around. Um, this actually isn't so good. Okay, that's that's horrible. It's whatever. Oh, this guy's just here. Oh, okay, he wasn't so bad. All right, where are we at? Caution! Wow, that sucks. It's whatever. We can do this. Use it here. We got enough green herbs. Alright. Second floor terrace. Should be. Like over here. Wait, was this it? I believe it was a stained glass window, wasn't it? Yeah, let's just try this real quick. Alright, it doesn't work. Um, we'll have the gun equipped too. We got ammo now. Yeah, what's the stained glass window? Hopefully after this, we can find our friends. Jill and Whisker. Yeah, it should be this. Kind of looked like this. It wasn't this. Maybe we weren't close enough. No. What was it? Is there another area like this? Is it this one? Maybe it was on the other side. Oh, we unlocked all the doors. I didn't know this was a sword door. Okay, and we discarded immediately too, which is good. So we have room now. So it's quiet. Pretty awfully quiet in here. I hear you. Yes, 100%. This lead outside to a balcony. Oh, this was where it was at. Are these herbs? No, I'm good. Um. Hmm. Why does this feel like a boss fight? Yeah, this is definitely it. Where are we? I want to explore around a bit before I call the dog. Ooh, that's ominous. Is this locked? This might be locked. Oh, I unlocked it. Oh, it was probably locked from the other side. Type of doors. Yeah. Okay, cool. So we got that unlocked. Let's check down here. So this is a good area. We can try to loop the dog. So 
The second we call it, let's come running here. And as a matter of fact, I think I'm gonna use this, just so we can be at full. Nice, so we're at full now? Nice. Alright, here we go. Stained glass window. Pattern in the center resembles a witch. How kind. We're out. Where is it coming? Oh, there it is! Uh, screw you, doggy. Oh, it's two of you! I don't like this. Best time to jump it is when it lunges. Aim, Chris. Aim. What are you doing? Oh, I'm dead. I am so dead. Well, guess who has to restart that all over? Alright, so guys, we done everything we did that led us to this point. Make sure we didn't miss anything, and it's time to use a dog whistle. Since I, since I know he's coming from that way, I'm just gonna immediately turn and fire off my gun. Let's run. Oh shit. Oh! Wait, am I dead? There's no way I'm dead. What? How? I didn't even get. That was the first hit. All right, so guys, I've uh, decided that I'm gonna save here because that was a lot of work. I ran around everywhere. I actually even burned a few more bodies, and this is what I have right now. I brought ink ribbons with me so I can save and I'm gonna save here and I'm gonna face off against these mangy mutts and I'm also gonna end the episode here so sorry to leave it off on a cliffhanger but if you enjoyed this episode stay tuned for more so see you guys next time